If m is equal to sin a into cos a, n is equal to secant a plus cosecant a, show that n into m square minus 1 is equal to 2 into m. That is 2 into sin a into cos a. First I take n. n is equal to secant a. Secant a is 1 by cos a. 1 by cos a. So 1 by sin a is equal to cosecant a. So this will become, this is cos a into sin a. Cos a into sin a. This is sin a plus cos a. So this is cos a. This is the term n. Okay. This is n. This is n. Okay. Next. Uh, here m square. What is m square? Here m is equal to sin square a. This is plus, sorry. This is plus sin a. m is equal to sin a plus cos a. Correct. Sin is equal to sin a plus cos a. m is equal to secant a plus cosecant a. Here m square is equal to, this is whole square. a plus b the whole square. a square sin square a. b square cos square a plus 2 sin a into cos a. Correct. Okay. We know that sin square a plus cos square a is equal to 1. This will become 1. Therefore, m square is equal to 1 plus 2 into sin a into cos a. Correct. Okay, that is a m square. This is m square. m square is equal to 1 plus 2 into sin a into cos a. Next, m square minus 1. That is equal to 1 minus 1 plus 2 into sin a into cos a. So, this two terms get given. Plus 1, minus 1 get cancelled. Okay. This will become 2 sin a into cos a. Correct. So, m square minus 1 is equal to 2 into sin a into cos a. So, what is the left hand side? n into m square minus 1. Correct. So that is equal to, what is n? n is equal to sin a, sin a plus cos a divided by cos a into sin a, sin a into m square minus 1. This is 2 into sin a into cos a. Here, these two terms get cancelled. The sin a, sin a get cancelled. Cos a, cos a get cancelled. We got, this will become 2 into sin a plus cos a. Here, n into n square minus 1. That is the left hand side. Left hand side is equal to right hand side. Here, this is 2 into sin a plus cos a. That is equal to 2 into m. Correct. This is 2 into m. This is the right hand side. This is the proof.